All new at five, it is a place of peace and prayer, but within seconds, the solace of a sanctuary can be shattered by violence. It is a scenario we've seen play out in places of worship all across the country. As News 5's Mike Brookbank tells us, several Akron area churches are now joining forces to make sure members of their congregations are safe. On Monday, members of several Summit County churches will gather here at the University of Akron to get a crash course on how to react during a crisis. In this day and age, who knows what could happen, what could walk through the front door. It's a risk Reverend Richard Gordon knows his church, Faith Lutheran, faces on a daily basis. Bombings and, and violence in churches, you know, it, it catches your attention. Gordon's biggest fear, someone looking to use his congregation to make a statement. Through some kind of a, maybe a terrorist activity or a shooting activity or a hostage activity, from the outside to better prepare for any of those scenarios and beef up plans already in place. There's a security going on where it's not always visible. Members of local churches will gather Monday for a faith based security summit with some of the things that have happened across the nation. It's made people more aware of the importance of getting out in front of and being proactive. Crisis teams along with the FBI and Department of Homeland Security will arm faith-based leaders with the tools to tackle the risks they face. Any plans or procedures that we can enact to assure that safety, we have to be interested in. We believe we are protected by the divine uh, providence of God. With that protection, Reverend Henry McNeil with Friendship Missionary Baptist Church tells me he's not worried. The kind of things we see happening on television just hasn't happened uh, in our churches and wouldn't for the most part. Reverend McNeil feels smaller churches like his are less likely to be on a gunman or terrorist radar. How you know when somebody's going to do that? You don't know that. So there you have to depend on the Lord to take care of you. Other congregations are clearly not comfortable taking the it can't happen here approach. I think that it would be absolutely a travesty to take that position because it can happen. Reporting from Akron, Mike Brookbank, News 5.